Saxon Course 2, Lesson 66 is on ratio word problems involving totals. So first I have the ratio of boys to girls at the assembly was 5 to 4. If there are 180 students in the assembly, how many girls were there? So first we start by making a my ratio box. But instead of having just two rows, I'm going to end up with three rows. So I have, so since it's boys to girls, I'm going to do boys on the top then girls, and then my final box is going to be my total. Okay, We still have the ratio in the first column and the actual count in my second column. So it says the ratio is 5 to 4. So I'm going to put the 5 in the boys, 4 girls, and then my total is going to be 5 plus 4, which is equal to 9. Then it says there are 180 students in the assembly. So my total actual count is going to be 180 students. Now we have to look to see what question is being asked. So they're asking how many girls there are. I don't need to know how many boys there are, so I'm going to cross that column off because I don't need to know. I'm looking for how many girls there are. So now I can create my proportion. So it's going to be 4 over 9 equals the girls over 180. Okay. We do cross products and I end up with 9 girls equals 720. Divide both sides by 9 and I end up with 80 girls at the assembly. So one more example, the ratio of football players to soccer players in the room was 5 to 7. If the football pl and soccer players in the room totaled 48, how many were football players? So again, draw my ratio box. Ratio, actual count. Okay, It's ratio of football players to soccer players. So football players go on top, soccer players go in the middle, and my total is at the end. So it's 5 to 7 which means my total is going to be 5 plus 7, which is 12. Okay. And then they totaled 48, so my actual count total will be 48. Again, I need to look to see what it's asking. It wants to know how many were football players. I don't need to know how many soccer players there are, so I'm going to cross that column off. Now I can make my proportion. So I have 5 over 12 equals my football players over 48. Okay. We do cross products and I end up with 12F equals 240 because I do 48 times 5. Divide both sides by 12 and I end up with 20 football players. And that's it for this lesson.